Hello everyone and welcome back to another, another very exciting chess game by Jose Raul Capablanca against Hermenis Matheson. He was the first Latvian chess champion and one of the strongest chess players in the early 1930s. So the story between these two players is also interesting. So Matheson actually faced with Jose Raul Capablanca in 1913 in a chess simul. So that was a simultaneous chess exhibition by Capablanca when he played against 29 different opponents. And Matheson defeated Capablanca in that chess simul. After many years later, after 1913, they never faced until this chess game until 1929. So let's see if what happened in this chess game. Can Jose Rol Capablanca get the revenge? When he was busy against 29 chess players in a chess simul. Of course, uh, he had the disadvantage because that was a chess simul, but this time this was a head-to-head -head chess game between Capablanca and Madison. So the game started with d4, knight to f6, c4, e6, knight to c3. So we have the Nimzo Indian defense. Usually black captures the knight and damages the pawn structure in the queen side. So queen to c2, c5, capturing and then not rushing for capturing the pawn bishop takes bishop to f4 d5 e3 queen to a5 and bishop up bishop goes back bishop to b4 and capablanca castled capturing the knight well capablanca doesn't want to lose the queen so he captured back and as you can see white has a weakness in the c file but usually uh, in these days, of course, capturing immediately, capturing the knight with the bishop is more common. Castling, sent a uh, rook from a to b1, queen in, centralizing the rook, pushing the pawn, and Capablanca captured the pawn, knight takes on d5, and we have knight to g5 by Jose Raul Capablanca, and now he's threatening checkmate. So defending like this, but in this position, what happens if going back with the knight? Can you see why this move is not working? Then we have bishop to d6, and that's a nasty skewer. The queen and the rook is under attack at the same time, so this is a losing position for black. So in this position, if g6, knight to e4, bishop can go to the uh, h6 dark square so you can see that black has some weaknesses in the dark squares so this position is also not looking good as you can see knight can check the king but computer actually says uh, black is doing uh, okay in this position but white is slightly better but in this position white is much better so you can see there are some weaknesses uh, bishop to f3 so this knight looks vulnerable queen to c5 for the extra defense and also attacking the c pawn how to defend pushing the pawn so of course the c pawn is pinned but capablanca is defending the pawn knight from d to b4 queen to b3 and now this knight is pinned so capablanca can take the knight e5 a3 kicking the knight back and actually in this position white has a winning move can you guess the next move of jose raul capablanca let me tell you this capablanca played the move and after that move black resigned it's that simple <laughs> capablanca got the revenge very quickly in a chess miniature Did you see this move? Black resigned. <laughs> it's that simple. So let me show you the possible continuation. Why black resigned? Now, first of all, if capturing the bishop, then pushing the pawn, and that's a nasty check. Now, how to defend? Of course, king to h8, then knight check, and king to g8, knight check, and we have a smothered mate, knight to f7, check, mate. In this position, if rook takes on f7, then we have check. This time black has a back rank issue and black is getting checkmated once again. 
so there is no defense as you can see okay so in this position obviously capturing the bishop is not working so in this position let's say capturing this bishop then simply capturing the rook bishop takes the rook and white is simply a rook up and this is all over for black and in this position after bishop takes on c6 if rook to b8 if defending the rook then bishop check and basically white is a rook up uh, sorry white is a piece up so this is also losing for black bishop takes on e5 and that's all she wrote so in this position white is a piece up so okay this was the very nice instructive chess game by jose Rol capablanca after capturing the knight with the bishop black simply resigned because of this obvious continuation checking the king and actually we have this beautiful smothered mate or black is basically getting checkmated at the back rank okay thank you very much for watching and i hope to see you next time so take care and bye bye